much she was waiting. Cal's back there at the bar was waiting, was taking her, had their phone out, was recording. I thought, what the heck, there weren't that many bikes. There was only like two or three. Then I just saw them, yeah. Couldn't get my phone up quick enough to do them from the front. There are bikes all over the place out here. There's another one sitting at the corner. Come on, what the hell are you doing? You gonna come over? Let's go. Support vehicle built backing into a off off road or something. Whatever up here. Let's see if we can get a picture of the crane. Come on, there, off the road. Can we go, please? Camper still has brake lights on. He hasn't moved yet. Let's see if we can get a picture. Dirt, leave the dirt piled up where you're going to set the containers up on top. 
side and dirt on the other side and dirt and back and then put a concrete floor or wood floor, put a wood floor in and have it heated with uh, heated water or electric wire or whatever. And then like I said, if, if it was big enough, if I'd use 53 foot containers, I'd dedicate maybe 10 feet of it in front, clear across, which would be uh, 53 feet. <laughs> Go back about 10 feet, and that would just be the living room and kitchen all in one type deal. And the bedroom suite would be in one container. The uh, spare bedrooms, two spare bedrooms with the shared bath in the back, the back container. And the other container would be a wood shop or, or something else, maybe. Maybe a pantry and laundry and utility room because the other half of the bottom you put the, the, the uh, wood shop and metal shop could be in the back half of the garage which is below but have that out you know buried in the hill on the uh, north side someplace overlooking the river and the mountain on the south Jesus Christ. How 
fucking stupid do you have to be to do that? I know that it's clear, but still, how much of an asshole, huh? Because he's in a fucking big hurry. I'm glad I was recording that. I fucking blow by his stupid fucking ass. You know, I bet nine times, nine out of ten up here, he'll fucking get off a chimney rock and go south someplace. And then that, that's just completely stupid. If you knew you're gonna turn, why not wait? Because you gotta be there first. I gotta be number one. I gotta be out in front. Well, he was number one in my book. Fucking dick. And then the pickup behind me wasn't gonna fucking let me in. Because he started coming up. respect for fucking trucks. It's only 60 mile an hour anyway. If he had his chance at Suburban up there, he'd probably be fucking doing 85 mile an hour. I'm sure the crane, you know, stopping for the crane, he just, he, he just couldn't handle that. Matter of fact, I don't even know where he came from because he was not behind me when we were there waiting for that crane truck to get off the road. The yellow car was behind me, the pickup that was behind me, and another pickup. I didn't see that fucking black suburban anywhere behind me back there. Here he goes, he's gonna speed. I'm just gonna fuck it. I'm fuck it, I don't care, I'm gonna do 60. If I catch the, catch the uh, camper, I'll pass him, but fuck it. He came on the inside to pass somebody on the le on the left lane, and he's back out in the left lane. He's gonna pass the other camper. The fucker's gotta be doing 90 mile an hour. He's up on the curb already. That's a half a mile away already. 60 mile an hour. 60 mile an hour speed zone out here. Everybody's in such a fucking hurry anymore. such a fucking hurry, why didn't you fucking leave a half an hour earlier? earlier? Fucking ass hats. Here. 